Okay, it's LP Vlog time. This time it is the season finale of Kevin Gavin of the MP Vlog with Shadow Play, written by Josh Haber and Nicole Dubach. Bath time makes sure, so good. I know she wanted a bunch of other stuff, but I don't know if so or not. Um, first gonna go in and go back from that. Do you not? Anyway, <laughs> anyway, so big go be a come across the season finale. So. Basically, Starburst, um, comes across, um, in Starburst, right? Sunburst, uh, Starburst, um, Sun, st Sunburst, comes across some journal from Star Cold the Bearded, which, I think we just summary. Um, I'll just read a bit of summary here. Sunburst shares his discovery of Star Cold Secret Journal with Twilight and a friend. Which reveals how the Corcoran and Equestria's other legendary heroes, known as the Pillars of Old Equestria, sacrifice themselves to defeat the monster Pony of Shadow. And while searching that, they prove the Pillars are still alive in the timeless realm of Limbo, which they imprison themselves in alongside Pony of Shadow. And they decide to go and free Star Dark World, and which ends up freeing the villain as well. <laughs> the last thing, basically. And yeah, Pony Shadow. The Pony Shadow from Cacomania? He's real. So, and that is the equation behind him. I'm sure we're contradicting some of it, but oh well. And I'm sure some stuff talk about here contradict what they did in that comic. Which, by the way, so, the story of Catfire Tale is our reference here, so we'll go over the hero mentioned in that episode. Which apparently could tie into a comic they were doing, which is by the Algonc Harpican Canon and Happy Day Humor. But, <laughs> Yeah, but uh, whatever. Anyway, so that big thing to make things from the finale, bringing a bunch of legendary uh, heroes together to stop the big villain. It's like the Pony Avenger. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, I, uh, I got a lot I got. Anyway, um, so we can the finale. Pretty good. And, yeah, can't, I'm not getting that. It's more than that. You probably know I don't like that kind of bunch of going to be other I don't care even like King Kick 1. If I have one guy can care like more because I feel like we carried more emotional stuff and interesting stuff. Okay, generally this one was mostly pretty good and consistently entertaining. I like some of the new location new or region getting old locations like the one from the health of information. Um yeah, that was a pretty good one. Um anyway, we even get some location go with a couple like early mostly we getting old ones, but we get with some new characters who don't get an awful lot to do, but I feel like they're some interesting moments with them too. I think you make get at least one decent moment. It's call them get more to do than they did in the movie, but <laughs> um, um but you know, oh well. Um but you know, blah go and it kinda of, and it's just cool. We get some interesting lore, which I think which we get done decently well. Oh, oh well, I'd be a couple I gotta bring up. This will be spoiled, by the way, but you can kind of tell what kind of what's going to happen anyway, so it's not gigantic. But I'll tell you when we get the things that are explicitly spoiled, and then I'll tell you in the description of the time sample, and spoilers are no longer here. But I'll tell you when they start, so don't worry. At least, for one particular spoiler, you already kind of know it's not that big of a deal. It happens in like a certain point, and not at the end, so it's not that big of a deal to me. Um. But in general, a lot of it is pretty entertaining. It's not giving a thing crazy new or different from the story in motion, but still consistently entertaining. I'm arguably consistently entertaining with a couple of the others. Um, one interesting thing is no song. Two teams like in a row with no song. In fact, I believe there's like five ish songs with in, in total. Um, and I believe a reason why they cut down the song with and and then I'm equal to the compensate for that is because of a movie. And I feel like some of the thing is primarily the decently well constructed in spite of the fact they're working on the movie. Um, you know, but um, in terms of Kong, there are five. Best Friend Till the End of Time, Bow for Sugar Bell, You're in My Head and Catch a Kong, Sonic, and Blank Thanks, whatever. That 2 and 2, You're in My Head and Catch a Kong, Blank Thanks, are particularly really good one. Got my favorite Blank Thanks, Blank Thanks. That's the first Kong show in a while I went back to look into again. Go out and really fun, but that five song, you know, and there were like twelve hundred preview vegan. Um, come look into one episode, I'll show you. But I blame the movie. Uh, I totally blame the movie for this. But anyway, um, the first big element is that um, it 
Pressure Gold one hundred percent can. I mean, we knew they can that before, but they didn't give us any particular hint to get kind of flat country, but only the pony version. So how we know human version again, you know? Yeah, you know. And of course, we found like appearing in Mirror Magic. You know, we're dragging things. You know, Starlight. You know, and, and we actually knew it against the, um, at the official game where they referenced the event of the Kitty Remark. So, like, you came back from that little adventure. But in this one, we kind of actually get to appear. We don't say anything. We see him in a flashback. But we see the flashback of how Stark will take care of him. But if you haven't seen him in Rock or anything like that, you don't need, you, they're just sirens. You don't need to know anything about them. Which is cool. I feel like, like they threw in that reference, but they didn't go too overboard with it. I liked that. Um, you know, it's not, not getting to go thing like story and whatever, because it's like, you know, but next to each other, I'm going to look like that until we get to part two, and, well, yeah, um, but a big thing of point is with the ending, in which they do a thing, they do a lot, and it kind of bothered me because it's been kind of they've been doing a lot, to the point where they did it even in the movie, and I'm kind of getting sick of it. And while it's done technically well for what it is, it's done kind of bother me because it felt particularly like we had no way to end this, so let's do this, you know? You know? And honestly, I don't think I need to pull it because you gotta kind of tell what I'm talking about somehow, gang. You know? That's a nice medium, I think. You know? And there's not a ton of stuff to cover that. And on top of that, I just fall into the problem I've had all you know, essentially of doing things we've seen before. And, you know, because the big thing we do with the villain is kind of similar to what we did with another villain, you know, combined with what we did. But basically, you get two things we've done with the villain combined, essentially. And I've seen work rehashing, of it, even this show. But this particular episode, it does feel like. I won't give any idea, but in terms of two parts, I won't give or kind of, you know, they are kind of like, they, this is more thing I think in terms of gimmick and all things that, but in terms of story, very clearly, I think he did going, you know, okay, which you will buy, but just going totally new, like, putting supporting characters in the spotlight, and not, and not, uh, and to have a main case, that's definitely kind of interesting, unique, versus this one where, it even turned the story more interesting, unique. Well, this one, storyline, can go down how you expect. But a lot of it's more fun and entertaining, go so in good, high good, but it's not quite great or very good in the same way. Come here and keep Well, in Kitty Mark, I feel like barely kind of able to get to that with this one. You know? And if, to be honest, if this was earlier in the series and i am coming up with code, didn't exist, I actually feel like we might be more po- I might be more positive on this one because it would be some. I haven't seen it like a million times on this show, you know? But, but it's got a cool new thing in like part one, which is why I think part one is probably even better. And the ending itself is nice, you know? It's just that, nothing crazy new. But Guy Brooking Star Wars like a decent job, if not doing a Jeffrey Tamworth impression at some point. Um, um, yeah, but we get to keep Star Wars, and he is nothing like he was in the comic book, but to be fair, you know? You know, without the years in there, kind of a crick in the neck. <laughs> you know, you know, I bet that kind of good kick of humor he apparently had. You know, I, I, again, I read, I'm not caught up with them. I don't think I will get caught up because I don't care as much anymore. They're coming back prequel to the movie. I'm kind of curious to me to give more, they give more information on Trump Gang, of course, that I might have to wait till after I review the movie because I don't care. About that kind of thing, and cool. you know, it's like I don't care about the peak information, but I have to peek out, yeah. But, but yeah, go look like I won't be getting kicked for it because I feel like just my gang, well, I'm scared you kind of gauge what I'm talking about. Yeah, go overall, shout out play, from all part, was pretty interesting and pretty fun. I liked because we do work. Okay, we can come over location and can do a cool thing with that. It's not too similar to in the movie going to come over location. Go over well, the movie is way more elaborate. Yeah. And the movie's coming after the cup of code in 14 and 8. So. Yeah. But, um. I'm curious whether Tim will be. Probably not. I can't get him to back. 
course, we're not gonna see uh, Sword King back. <laughs> uh, that's a little fat. I did, I did bring that up in the video, did I? Uh, but eh, whatever. For that, for the movie. Um, but I do think it, it goes down by you can come out with that. You can get two part ten to follow up with Kick Formula, which is fine. It's just that they're very. It's like conventions versus cliche. There's no convention you associate with a two longer show that I'm fine with. It's the cliche, like what we do in the end is what ultimately kind of bothers me. But still, pretty good going there. Pretty fun finale. And I like how we do kind of get up for an element like Little Legend, the tail of the code, and a few other ones. So it's not to be totally. Each new finale, I think, is deeply built up to, so it doesn't feel random. That was going to be doing this stuff, go so, that nah, I find the way. Okay, that that took care of thing. Um, yeah, so a bit of repeat, but then the topic of moving a fun over thing. And if you like Bob, you if you could view a complete on the American cover, I think from Night Queen, and I feel like it was one of the first time we did it, I would applaud them and came down decently well. It's not a main link, so. In terms of the, you know. We do, you know, you know, but um, I can't talk in kitchen and call and entertaining. It's just that I did kind of call it when I call what we are doing. It's just that in terms of being deep, it's not too, you know, deep or interesting, but still kind of fun. Go back to try to play the game finale. I won't say it's not when the game finale can go, ooh, I can't be for next game because a lot of you haven't done that as much, but I think that's fine. <laughs> yeah, but I think it's kind of quite better because we can get open two parts. Go so, um, but yeah, go back and see again before you have a vlog. I feel about similar I did not see and cake, but I will have to say, I want to say I felt a little more comfortable calling her up looking really good in the skin, but, you know, but at the same time, but at the same time, uh, I was showing kind of, when the show gets up to the point of run going to impress you, so a lot of, even some of we like, did think I had seen before in the show, like, or, you know, so, uh, my favorite would be her favorite could give a book original and she'll go for the show. Obviously, it's not the original story, but it's going to be in the before the show, you know? You know, and if you ever want to do the same thing, you know? You know, and again, um, you know, yeah, I'll go quite like, you know, Fair Philly and Corner Harmony was going to another one that usually is, you know, not a good show, but. But we can just call it up and go kind of like that for you. If we're fully baking, baking off another episode, that quite like so. Um, but I don't think so. Need to totally think they need to totally do well. And the king and king did think they did well, just not. I walked the king. King kind of like a little lesson king of five, and I know some people, there's a lot of debate on which king and poking for have been the best or whatever. You know, I want. <laughs> yeah, but personally, I feel like that's me and I felt more passionate about, especially while I'm really good at the code. And I don't think any episode of King Kong Kevin reaches pipes in my favorite community. If I go back and rewatch them, which at some point I probably will, you know, I, I might change, but I can't find like a few all time favorite for the hearing. King Kong Kevin really didn't. He, my all time favorite King Kong Kevin probably hard for me to tell, but like I said, it's more entertaining value than the writing to get it going to care all essentially. Um, and <laughs> preparing for it. Well, I guess not quite top 20 to show because we're up going back to do a big one for playing better now. Or the show even in other. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but I don't think that's that big of a deal. I mean, certainly I'm, I feel like it's very constantly entertaining and you can or consistently decent. Queen Kevin is definitely kind of skip part two because it continues to come quality of that one. <laughs> yeah. I'm not gonna be one of those people who think going downhill or like that. Slightly lesser. But when we go from our time, that's bound to happen. No matter how long you're trying, and they are trying, they're trying way harder than even the game. Okay, well, I think we're we'll trying to do recently, and kind of clear things a little more mixed. But, think so, we're definitely trying the hardest. So, it's not like, well, oh, it's more like, we get to a certain point, you run, out, you run out of way to impress your audience. But, the small, we still get up and going around, and turn new and impress it down again. It doesn't matter me too much. All my least favorite of course, Gaunt Apple. I do get what they're going for, and but I feel like it's better if they get for the alternate moral rather than the moral they end up going with, you know? <laughs> you know? Yeah.
Yeah, you know, finger tone can keep playing or tank, uh, but then I'm good, but that we flunk and yada yada yada. But oh well, can't be too mad. God the tank, tang, all the deep can tongue, and budging it. That you do kind of hope, you know, kind of really kind of do a lot more than what you think. Get dug, get fallen, get a trapping, get yep, go do. Um, we do know Tier apparently coming back. I didn't read any details, but apparently you know, if it, if they fucking redeem him, I swear. Um, also Kulu has left me on going to all the time, but cool. <laughs> okay, I think we're done here. I spent more time on it. Hmm, Kevin. That's fifteen minutes for forty minutes up and go to go. Chat play a fun little finale though. Sound great for high school and kind of kick and hold will be good, I can kick while just doing it great or practice. But that's fine. I feel like I don't enjoy most of the game because I I'll give it credit that it's better than other show can get, but I want to admit my appreciation for show and love has gone down a little bit and I feel like if things were better I might have easier time. Although when show goes on for a lot of time that can happen. Even if the show kick up a little you know, quality, you know. Go ahead, can you go in and out, fetch a new show and come in and get me interested, go. So, yeah. But if I'll see you back in, well, first of all, the next vlog I'm gonna do is like a first special one of Big Hero Kick. Period. And then the December for the Mob Burst Free Crypto Code. And then who knows. But for the big vlog, well, apparently April is when I'm supposed to get the thing for my little Crocodile thing. And that's probably around when LP and um, 8 gonna start. I mean, from the last few things are gonna fall into King. Going going in the spring area. Hey, if I'm in April, I uh, think March and think kind of in April go probably and they've two in a row and then they come around the October stage with one being November, but kind of, uh yeah. Um but there you go. So I'll see you for when he ain't in probably the next spring area. I'm glad I'm not gonna do a mini vlog good guy again because I'm slightly that passionate to go pee. I think I'm like interested in V vlog, you know. No, but again, uh, which is why I do feel like I'm gonna new vlog here, you know, like I really want to. But I shall see you in November for okay, and then then December for Milo. So I shall see you all and.